What's going on, nation? Today, Erica and I are gonna share with you two ideas for high-protein crepes. And these recipes are great if you're on the go and you don't have a lot of time to prepare your meal. We're gonna show you two versions. One is a salty version, if you like a sweet and savory type of flavor, that has turkey breast and fat-free cheese. And we're gonna show you a sweet version with peanut butter and banana, which is a great option for a pre-workout meal. And no matter what version you're using, the base crepe is always going to be the same, which is these ingredients right here. It's going to have 242 calories, 8 grams of fat, 7 grams of carbs, and it's going to be packed with 35 grams of protein. So the base of the crepe is actually pretty easy to make. We like easy recipes because we are always on the go. Uh, so you're going to use one egg, You're just going to mix everything in a bowl and then one egg white. There you go. Three tablespoons of almond milk or coconut milk. I like either one as long as you use unsweetened. Two, three. One scoop of Synthesix isolate vanilla flavor. So you're going to use vanilla flavored protein powder. So pretty easy, that's your base. You're gonna mix it pretty well. Now for the ladies out there, if you wanna cut the calories a little bit, and I do this a lot, instead of using one whole egg and one egg white, just use two egg whites. So you cut about 55 calories out of the recipe and it still tastes really good. All right, so make sure it's nice and thick. I'm gonna spray cooking spray on my griddle and you can use a griddle or if you don't have one you can do just a regular um, skillet or a pan and that will work just as well. So remember one batch is gonna make two crepes actually so you're gonna pour about half of your batter in the skillet and since this is a crepe you want to spread it in such a manner that it turns out round and fairly thin. While that is going, I'm going to get my turkey breast ready to go right here. And then I have my quarter cup of fat-free mozzarella cheese. You can use any type of cheese you like. Um, I like mozzarella because it's nice and smooth and creamy and I always pick the fat-free version because cheese can be packed in fat if you're not careful. Your turkey breast and about half of your quarter cup of cheese because remember this is two batches let it heat up and melt real nicely. And your first crepe is ready to go. Now let's go for number two. All right, so there you have it. So this is the first version, the salty version. So here you have 337 calories total, eight grams of fat, only 13 grams of carbs, and 54 grams of protein right here. Delicious. So as you guys can see, I already prepared the base for my crepes. Now I'm going to be showing you guys the version that contains peanut butter and bananas. So it's going to have more calories and more carbs, which makes it a little bit better of a pre-workout meal, especially if you're on the go. And now the part Erica's been waiting for the whole time. She thinks I can't do this. Oh, <laughs> it was close. <laughs> I am so impressed. Now, for this crepe, it's going to have 552 calories, 
24 grams of fat, 40 grams of protein, and I mean 40 grams of carbs and 55 grams of protein. And that's both of them together. So what we're gonna do, while this one finishes up, is we're going to get, is it a tablespoon, sweetie? Yes, So one each half. One tablespoon for each one. And then what we're gonna do is put half of a banana on each one. So what I'm gonna do now is just put a touch of fat-free whipped cream on here just to kind of cover up my mistakes. No, <laughs> just to give it a little more taste. <laughs> now doesn't that look delicious? So there you guys have it, two delicious versions when making crepes. Yes, you can do the salty version with the turkey and cheese or the sweet version with peanut butter and banana. But remember, you can make the crepe your own as well. You can use strawberries, blueberries, almond butter instead of peanut butter, whatever you choose to do. And remember guys, if you want to see the full write-up with the directions as well as the ingredients, just click over in the link in the lower left-hand corner of the video. So for more great tips, exercises, routines, and recipes, be sure to join us on scottherbanfitness.com. And as always, more good stuff coming soon. See, See you guys. If you're looking for a quick way to switch things up, log into your SHF profile and go to the workout section of the website. Once there, click on the muscles you want to train, then you'll be brought to a page where you can further filter down your search. Now you have a complete list of all the routines that target your chest and utilize only a barbell or dumbbell. From here you can rate the routine, add it to your routines in your profile, and if you scroll down you can see a write up of the entire routine as well as photos of all the exercises. You can also download a printable PDF just by clicking on it.